everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, hope everyone is doing okay. It is Tuesday and um, kids are already done with their homework, schoolwork, which is actually pretty quick for today. Um, um, and so today's video is a little different. I want to share with you guys, especially it's um, with the whole quarantine going on. Um, I'm, you know, doing a lot of self-care lately. And so I wanted to share with you one of the things that I do for self-care. And um, it is my nails. Now, not my toes, but my nails we're going to talk about today. And I have a video that I've done where it's just a quick DIY for nails. But I wanted to show you practically every product that I use on a, not daily basis, but I would say I paint my nails every um, three or four days because I like to change up the color. Um, and so I wanted to show you the things that I use to keep up with my nails when I don't go and get my nails done. This is at home DIY nails. Let me get some coffee real quick. Um, so the first thing I do, of course, is I, if I have nail polish on, I take it off with, you know, an alcohol with a, a swab and everything like that, wash my hands, and then I'll start filing my nail, nails. This is actually kind of an old nail file. It is washable and you can sanitize it. It is the Beauty Secrets Super... Su superior nail products and it's kind of dreary now because I have been using it. I got it at Sally's uh, Beauty years ago and it's still really really good. It's very inexpensive. I think it was less than five bucks if I believe. Don't quote me on that but I believe. Um, it is reusable, uh, washable, all that so I do need to wash it. Um, okay so the next thing I do is I use a, when I start painting my nails, I use a base coat and a lot of the stuff I have gotten at the Dollar Tree in fact. This is the LA Colors Mega Glow, I'm sorry, Mega Grow and it's a nail treatment. You can use it for a base coat and this is what it looks like. It's kind of hard to tell um, with the packaging because it is clear with red writing but you can get this at the not um, sorry at the Dollar Tree this stuff works great as a base coat and then do any color nail polish you want I usually do about two coats this is the current one I have on right now it is the wet n wild one step wonder gel nail color in what was I be with you and this is what it looks like it actually didn't turn out to be the same color as the packaging, which is kind of interesting, but um, I still love it. So yeah, this is the color I have. And I will uh, pop up a picture right here of the display of nail polishes. This is the way I display them. In fact, I want to get one that you can hang up on the wall because I have a lot more nail polishes, but this is what I have um displayed this display my husband got for me years ago i think off of amazon um if i can find it on amazon i'll link it down below for you guys um but yeah so this is that and i actually don't have one of those manicure set thingies that you can um like trim and everything i did get one a while back and i can't find it so i don't cut my cuticles or anything like that all i do is just file them um, my cuticles are somewhat okay right now, so I'm surprised. All right, the next thing I do is put a base coat, I'm sorry, a top coat on, and the one I use is the Kiss Gel Shine Nail Polish, and it's just a clear coat, and of course, I got this at the Dollar Tree. Um, Kiss Gel Polishes are one of my favorites, and as you saw the vid the photo I posted, I have a lot of, of the Kiss Gel Polishes, um, I can do a collect collective haul on that or collection haul, collection video, or whatever it's called. If you want, comment down below and I'll show you the different ones that I got and they're all from the Dollar Tree. So very inexpensive. All right. And so when, um, then I discovered this product that I got 
at Walgreens a while back and it is a lifesaver for when you want your nails to dry a lot quicker and I love it. I give it 10 thumbs up if I could. Um, and it's the nail polish drying spray and this is what it looks like. Um, so you wait about a minute or two after uh, polishing your nails. Hold on guys, don't argue, okay? Um, and then you spray your nails twice each and it helps dry your nail polish a lot quicker. This stuff is amazing. Um, I'm pretty sure you can get it at any other store, but this is where I found it. I'm almost out of it. This one is 8.5 ounces <clears throat> and it's definitely a lifesaver. <clears throat> Excuse me, let me get a cup of coffee. Here, a sip of it. Okay, so this definitely is a lifesaver for when you want your nails to dry a lot faster and you don't have one of those machines, you know? All right, and then to help maintain the health of my nails, I use a cuticle oil every single night with some hand cream. And these are the two that I currently have. Um, one of them I'm almost, not almost out of, but you don't need a lot because a cuticle oil, oil goes pretty far. So this is the Sassy and Chic Cuticle Oil and Nail Strengthener, and I got this at the Dollar Tree. It is amazing. And then this is the Sally Hansen Big Cuticle Oil, and it's just as good as well. Um, it was about less than four bucks, but if you want something cheaper, you can get this one at the Dollar Tree, and it's just as good. So I rub that on my, my nails every night, and then I use a heavy duty hand cream and this is the Body Ecology Shea Butter Hand Cream and I love this stuff. It's thick and it's great for nighttime for your hands to stay healthy and soft. So I use this after the cuticle oil and then sometimes when I take my nail polish off and I want my nails to kind of like get a break from any type of nail polish, I use this. You just need a very little. It is the Sally Hansen Gel Rehab strengthener uh for fortinafate i don't know but basically you apply two coats on bare nails at night let dry wash off in the morning and this helps strengthen and get your nails a lot healthier not sure if you can see that with it focusing or not um but i think i got this at target but i'm pretty sure you can get it at any type of drugstore this stuff is amazing for when i want my nails be bare and for them to um, get a lot stronger and healthier. So yeah, this is what I do. I would say I do the oil and hand cream every single night and then um, the polish and stuff I usually do about every four days um, because I like to change up my nails um, every so often. So that is it for the video i hope i give you some tips and tricks on keeping your nails nice especially around this time you do want to you know take some self-care and pamper yourself especially since we can't go to the nail salon um so yeah enjoy yourselves hope you guys are having a wonderful tuesday and i'll see you in my next video bye everyone